Okay guys, uh, Logic 10.4, the file tempo edit window. Um, I said in the review tutorial I did yesterday, I said that these two actions don't work. They're broken and actually they're not listed by Apple in their official documentation. Now I've had a reply this morning from the Apple development team and they confirm that yes, I have found a bug. Uh, these two things are broken and they're working on them. Okay, now this action item is supposed to adjust the tempo of the region to fit the project. Lining up the bars and beats with the bars and beats of the song, but stretching or shrinking the audio to fit the project tempo. It doesn't work. If you do it, nothing happens. Right? So the workaround is this, because what's supposed to happen, as far as I understand it now, from this reply from Apple, is that when you choose this adapt the region tempo to the project tempo, it's supposed to put the flex automatically on the piece of audio and then stretch it or shrink it to conform to the project tempo. Right? But that automatic flexing in the background isn't working. So this is the workaround in the meantime to make the piece of audio conform to the project tempo. You've got to switch the flex on manually yourself. Like that. Okay, and then it's done it. Bam. All right. And now, if you zoom in, you can see the bar and beat lines have been lined up exactly on bars and beats. This is based on what Logic thinks is the opening, you know, the opening bit of bass there. Look. Right. So let's see with the metronome on what's going on. So there's the opening bit of the first transient that Logic sees as a downbeat. One, two, three, four. The next downbeat. One, two, three, four. So there's the first downbeat there, which it's put on bar seven. It's shifted the whole thing forward this way so that that first downbeat that first downbeat there is on a bar line and um, it's done it by god it's done it so let's just put some drums to it um i don't know what rock it's got some swing to it this hasn't it it's um it's moon dance by bloody van morrison i can't stand van morrison <laughs> sorry i don't like his music <laughs> everyone likes van morrison or a lot of musicians older musicians do i can't bloody stick him now we've got to get a right drum beat for this. So I'll put some swing on it. And look at that, it works really well. Really well, actually. Um, yeah, you see the silence at the beginning of this bit of bass playing. So if you didn't want the bass to begin at bar seven, then you just trim this back. You know, like that, and then come on. Oh, bloody snap to absolute value. Thank you. Right, and then you can just move the whole thing to begin earlier, like that. Like so, the whole thing begins on bar two. Or you could trim this right to that first transient there, oh, and then the whole thing, and then the whole thing could begin at bar one. Like that. Okay, so here we go. Get back there. Actually, we could try one of the new brush drummers with this, couldn't we? I've never had an opportunity to try one. What genre are they in? Come on, undo. Yeah, let's go back to Kyle with a bit of swing. I'll just have him playing ride instead of um, hi hat. It's working, isn't it? That's really good. <laughs> the whole thing's been fitted to the project tempo and all the downbeats and quarter beats are there and everything. I mean, this was a really long piece of bass.
Yeah, man, that's brilliant. Now, here's the thing. So, this is the one that's broken. Adapt the region tempo to the project tempo, which it's now done by just manually switching on flex. But that should happen automatically in the background. This other one, adapt the project tempo on all regions to the region tempo, is the same as this one, except, you know, which, which does work. That changes uh, the project tempo to fit the region, right? But this second command that isn't working, a second action, changes the project tempo to fit the region, but it also should automatically flex and adjust all other audio regions on the project to conform to that new tempo being provided by the analysed piece of audio. So both of these are not working because the automatic flexing in the background isn't happening. Okay, so Apple are working on that and they're going to fix it. There. And now you can have all the ghastly Van Morrison that you like. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that's pretty damn good though. That I'm impressed. I'm impressed. Impressive. Most impressive. <laughs>